Princess Kate and Prince William refuse request to move into bigger home for two reasons. The Prince and Princess of Wales are reportedly choosing to stay put, as Prince Andrew is on the hook for Royal Lodge payments. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British royal family. Princess Kate and Prince William have rejected a rumoured move that would have constituted a major upgrade for the couple, a royal author has claimed. Recent reports have alluded to a potential move from their current Adelaide Cottage residence to Royal Lodge, the expansive home of Prince Andrew and Sarah Ferguson, the Duchess of York. It was alleged that King Charles III was considering handing the Duke of York an eviction notice in a bid to slim down the monarchy's spending. But he received a stay of execution in October 2023 that allowed him to stay put, at least for now. Royal author Robert Hardman said the move may still happen but the Prince and Princess of Wales have two good reasons not to follow through. Writing in his new book, The Making of a King, King Charles III and the Modern Monarchy, Mr Hardman said the couple are extremely happy at Adelaide Cottage. The author quoted a royal official who unveiled two reasons why the couple might not want to move from their current home. They said, they are there as a family with total privacy and without lots of staff. Mr Hardman added that the rumoured move from Adelaide Cottage to the Royal Lodge might happen, but the resettlement is currently not planned. The Duke of York's eviction immunity is reportedly not permanent, as it depends on him following through on demands outlined in his Crown Estate Lease Agreement. He is said to be responsible for coming up with the funds to make repairs at the Grade 2 listed Windsor Estate property. The repairs will reportedly set the Royal back approximately £2 million, and he has already paid a tenth of that total. Prince Andrew has, so far, spent £200,000 as an interim payment, but will need to pay the rest to remain there. He will reportedly struggle to meet the remaining costs, a family friend told Mail Online, who said none of the royals believe there is any realistic chance he could stay at the property. They said, it's all a bit cloud cuckoo land, I'm afraid. No one, not least His Majesty, believes there is any realistic, long-term chance of the Duke of York being able to keep the roof at Royal Lodge over his head.